guys, um, welcome back to Yusin's um, Aurelia Autopilot um, test and um, as you can see our wonderful uh, system is um, nearly complete, so it's only got one thing left. This is going to be the simple version of Aurelia, and there's going to be two versions of um, this Autopilot, the advanced version and the simple version. A uh, simple version, as you can see, is just these. You've got vertical speed hold, head in hold, and altitude hold. Um, when you have the auto, now obviously it's not going to be in this um, terrible UI. It's going to be integrated in this type of uh, looking UI, okay? And this will be switchable. Um, this side will be switchable, so you can switch between the pilot log, because all of these, all of these gizmos are switchable. That's the intent of them. Anyway, to get back to the basics, um, this quite simply, at the moment, when you have your AP on and you have nothing on, wing, the only thing that will be always enabled when you have autopilot is the um, A350 stabilizer. So it has a computer that will stabilize the wings. Because if you've noticed, if you fly this A350 or fly any plane, even in the real world, the wings will never always be level there's always a computer that does calculations and that's what you have here if i turn this ap off you will slowly uh, start seeing that this plane will start um rolling see it's beginning to roll on our ai um and when it starts rolling because um it does two things when your bank changes you start losing lift and when you start losing lift see this vs here it's going down um and it's going down fast that's because well we're losing lift so as you can see we're turning if i turn on this ap now wings have gone back to normal okay so anyway um we, the video is not just about this uh stabilizer the video is about our fun heading so if um if i want to go to a heading of 90 okay Oops, control show. I turn on that and it's gonna go over there. When you have the heading you must also apply some lift um, via pitch like real world because you should never have this vertical speed on when you're using the heading for the simple reason of um, for the simple reason of vertical speed will lock you out of being able to pitch and when you're banking you lose lift so when you use the heading you're still going to be manually controlling things like the throttle um, and you're going to be controlling the pitch but that's it it will control the turning for you but you will still do for it the pitch okay um, and um, so as you can see I'm turning there I'm going to put a bit of pitch just to help it stay still um, obviously when this stabilizes and your hock your hock becomes zero you can turn your vertical speed on no problem so as you can see my hock is now pretty much within a range I can turn my vertical speed on so I'm going to turn my vertical speed on to 3000 it's going to maintain 3000 for me All right so that's that everything is fine so obviously we'll be doing corrections and you'll be able to see basically so hawk is just telling the plane that come on you're off course now you're off your head in and it will tell the system to correct itself obviously if there's no problem with your hawk so if you're imperfect then obviously you won't get the autopilot giving corrections okay and you always you'll notice because it will be very stable and when it's not stable that's it's correcting so that's that um so as you can see our VS speed is 3000 3000 is climb speed if you put this to negative you start uh, diving and the good thing about this computer system is even though you put this to a negative value the computer will always try and force the plane um, upwards because it will not let you get into a full dive so um, it will put more pressure on correcting um, the plane when it goes below um, a set threshold um, as you're seeing now 
Okay, so it is diving now, as you can see. I'm gonna put this straight to zero, to zero VS um, first speed because I'd rather do that now. Um, and you'd rather fly a bit more level. So this is zero vert speed with we are leveling out. Um, that's pretty much how you level out. Because in real world, the plane will always, planes don't fly, um, they don't fly straight. They're always, there's always a bit of the plane still going upwards. If you have a plane flying like that, it's just, it's very quickly easy for it to go down. Um, which you don't obviously want. You want to really keep to be still fighting gravity, but not, um, you know, s severely increasing your altitude. So as you can see, that my altitude is hanging around um, an average of three, three eighteen. And if I feel like, obviously, um, you know, we're still going a bit too fast or whatever. So throttle and um, when you have this, these two on, the only thing you'll be controlling now is the rudder and the throttle for any small major corrections you want, okay? By the way, no, even though I put a, f a vertical speed of um, 30,000, planes don't always, um, on the autopilot, will not go that fast up to 30,000. Because obviously, you wouldn't want your plane, um, if it had a malfunction and it put itself to 100,000 vertical speed, you wouldn't want it to have full, um, full pitch control as if you were the pilot. Because if I turn this, as you can see, the pitch. Um, this is the maximum, it's, it's actually applying maximum um, elevator to try and get us up, but there's a limit for it to do this. Because if I turn um, vertical speed off, okay, if I, turn vertical, if I turn vertical speed off, you can see just how uh, higher we're going. See, we're now lifting like insanely high, insanely high. We're going that is how insane it is. Okay, now if I turn on that AP and I tell I tell him, put me down to uh, 5,000. Okay, let's see if it, I wonder if it can auto correct itself. Um, so, let's check would it auto correct itself? Would it save us from our dive? Will we end up dying first? I'm gonna put that down to 85%. It looks like it's about to save the plane, interestingly enough. And as I said, you shouldn't really have your vertical speed and your heading on at the same time. Um, especially if the heading is correcting, you should have vertical speed off. But yeah, it kind of saved us right now from the dive. Um, so we're not dead. So, hey. It works wonders. Um, so anyway, yeah, it's nearly done. All that's left is altitude, and then we're completely done. Thanks for tuning in, and bye.